What is up? We got another chance for Starboard Bow to do a review. I got this in the one of my pick up one of my packages, and I want to go over this this uh, compressor with you. So let's do this. We got another Starboard Bow review. This let's check it out. Vac Life air pump for car and home. 110 volt. Also has a DC 12 volt. That's pretty cool. DC and AC so I guess you can do in the house and in the uh, automobile let's check it out it just so happens my cousin's uh, car is here and the light came on in the dashboard to check his uh, air temps it's perfect timing you guys would get bored me checking other people's cars well let's do this car let's uh, check out the, the vac life here. air pump uh, let's go over the slow information not to bore you guys but I think it's important that I'm not one of those guys that who needs the instructions, but let's check it out. We got the it's only app for 12 volt cigarette lighter outlet and vehicles with uh, less than 245 millimeters. Do not use in large vehicles with exceeds a tire with a 24 volt outlet such as trucks. That's why I'm not doing it in my mobile home. You shouldn't be doing it in the mobile home, especially with tires like uh, my mobile home the tires that are 80 psi. You don't do it in cars, which is the best way to do it. It says the using duration should not exceed eight minutes. That's why they want you to do it in cars and under 50 PSI. Because, you know, an 80 PSI, if you're down by 20 pounds, that could, that could add up. And they don't want you to, to run it from, for to exceed eight, eight minutes. Uh, and then after eight minutes, you got to let it rest and, you know, cool down. So, so it's a little start. The engine says do not pull on the hose. No kidding. That makes common sense. But... First thing you want to do, obviously, is uh, you want to look, Bill, what's the PSI on this tire? Look on the tire right over here. Let's check it out. We got uh, one thing about these tires, they always make it hard as shit to tell what the PSI is. Tire pressure on this thing is, what do we say, Bill, 60 PSI? 51 PSI, right? 51 is the max. Okay, it max. Do it. Let's see, what is, what's it at right now? What does that thing say? 35. Right now it's at 36. So we're going to go ahead and set this sucker up to, let's just say, 43 to be safe okay. on each tire. What do you think, Bill? Yep. All right, let's do that. So let's pull out this vac life. Ooh, cool. There's your little, uh, for all your gaming water pressure tubes, basketballs, all that stuff, and that little fuse right there is for your 12 volt connector that goes into the lighter once in a while if your vacolite blows for some reason can't start or stop you always pull uh, out your oops you always pull this out right here unscrew that sucker and you'll see a fuse like that inside here okay so what we're going to get billy to do is plug this part into your cigarette lighter of your car Ooh, nice box too Bill. you're going to like this I'm gonna give this to my cousin Bill because he helps me out with a lot of a lot of uh, he helps me out with a lot of these uh, videos. So let's see, those are nice packaging on this thing too. My gosh, wow! I really like this thing. I might not give it to my cousin Bill. I might not give this to Billy. It's too nice. Oh, let's see. Oh, look at this thing! Wow! Holy jeez! Wow, vac life. Oh, there you go. So it's got the, oh, you've got the AC adapter and then the 12-volt adapter you on the plug, right. You can plug. You can plug this in to the house. If you have a two, and if you don't have one, then you use the, then you use the 12-volt. So let's plug. Ooh, this is really nice. Check this out. Yeah. Oh, look at this. It has a, uh, it has a flashlight emergency. Check that out. Look at that light. Oh, we got to plug it in first. <laughs> plug that into your... Oh, you got to plug it in? 
Here we go. Let me see. Yep, there you go. Okay, that's plugged in. Wow, that's pretty cool. Pressure. Oh, there you go. So zero. So what you got to do is go down here to the plus sign. Let's get that to six to forty-three. Boom! Right there. Okay. So now you take. So now it's breaking. Turn this upside down. Oh no! Back. I'm sorry. Turn around. Isn't it? Yep. Pull that out. Put this on the tire. Boom. And you come over here and the beautiful looking yeah, look at this device, boy. This is wow, I'm impressed. I really like that. Now we should have a button on here. Because you already set it automatically. So let's see. Press that power button right there, Bill. Second button to the right. Bam. Now this should blow up the tires to 43 and then automatically shut off. So let's see what happens. Another thing, if you guys can, yeah, it's gonna go up. Another thing, guys, that if you're on the side of the road, see that light? The next light is the emergency light. So you put this like this, so when you're on the side of the road at night, when you're on the side of the road at night, you don't get run over. How cool is that? What do we got? Where are we at? 36. Hopefully. This doesn't take more than eight minutes to blow this up to 43. There it goes. It's gone. Check that light out, though. How cool is that light? And you can just turn it off. Boom. Oh, I like that. No, no. It only runs off 12 volt or AC. That some reason. Now, guys, <clears throat> this right now is plugged into the 12 volt cigarette lighter in this car. Some cars, you have to turn the key all the way to the right to, you know, to get power. But obviously, with this car, you just need to plug it in. Where we at 40. Getting there, boys and girls. You automatically shut off at 43. And then we'll go around to all the tires and make sure it's all exactly at 43. So you normally, would it say 51 PSI? It says 59 PSI. Yeah. yeah. Let's do 42 just to be safe. Okay, let's do 42 to be safe. Can that Four tires up for this air pump and this vac life. I want to thank Vac Life Air Pump for Car and Home to send this to me for me to do one of their reviews. I really appreciate it. And let me tell you, people always say about these devices, oh yeah, but they're all the same. You know what? So what? They're all the same. But they're not all the same. Like this vac life right here has that emergency light in the back, which I like. So that when you press it, you're facing the, uh, you know, you're facing the street, especially at night, right? You're always going to do that. You put it on the emergency light, that's, you're going to need that. So what if they're all the same? But look at this thing. I have a couple others that don't have the handle like this. You can walk around when it's a regular light, right? Also, they don't have it so that you can plug it into AC adapter. They only have it if you have the 12-volt adapter. This has both the 12-volt adapter and the AC adapter. So what are you going to do? Blow up your tires, blow up your tubes, blow up anything you want with this vac life. I totally recommend it for especially us RV nomads. Get this inside your vehicle. Now, I should say things I don't like, I do like. I like the color, I like the box, I like the way they made it, I like the emergency light on the inside, I like the LED screens, very, very easy to read. Different opportunities for, for 12 volt and twig thing I don't like which is okay because I don't need I don't have a car but I have an RV you can't use this on the RV it only goes up to 60 psi I think or 58 psi I think it said but you do have it in the back of your trunk 
and that's where you want this sucker. You want this vac life in the back of that trunk, so when those tires get lose some air, boom, you throw it in. How sucky is it to go to a, uh, a garage or any type of uh, gas station looking for an uh, air pump to use? They either charging you or you can't get the cable over or you can't run. This thing you can do right at the house and it takes two seconds. And with the setup to 50 PSI or whatever you set it for and you hit go, it does it on its own. So there you go, Vac Life. I recommend it. Thanks for Boom. watching Vac Life. Totally recommend it. Oop, wait, let's get it right there. Oop, oop, oop. Boom, Vac Life. Totally recommend it. Thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing, liking. Please comment on my videos. Let me know what you think, and I'll get back to you guys. Have a great day.